All right, everyone. So it is Tuesday evening, and we're going to eat supper, and it's left overnight, meaning the taco pizza. And as I put on the video from yesterday, I forgot the main ingredient, which is the Doritos. Yeah, you need the beans and the meat, blah, blah, blah. But the Doritos really make the taco pizza. So today I went out and I got some Doritos upside down. But So I just, I'm just going to smash them up. You can leave them big, leave them small, whatever. Glenn would like them small. It's easier to eat when they're small too. All right. So now I'm just going to spread some Doritos on here. So these three are mine. These are Glenn's. It has been raining all day long. And we were expecting it. Uh, it showed it in the weather report. All right, I'm going to get this in the oven and have a real taco pizza tonight. <laughs> All right, everyone. So today I went to the final monthly food pantry uh, uh, for the month of October. And this is just some of the items we got. This, These items here are donated and some of the other items also like the dairy products. And the meat products, actually. Uh, these are donated by Quick Trip. They are a chain convenience store slash gas station here in the state of Wisconsin. I'm not sure if they're anywhere else, but they're very popular here. And they donate a lot to this monthly uh, food pantry. So let's get right into it. We got this nice sized meal, spicy chicken panne. And Glenn will probably try that for lunch tomorrow. Um, I won't eat it because, as you know, I don't do spicy. So that kind of killed it for me. And uh, we got garlic breadsticks. These are really good when they're warm. And usually they come, if you walk in the store, they come two in a bag. And they've got like mozzarella cheese in the middle. So you throw these in the oven and those are going to be really good. We've got some uh, vending machine sandwiches. We got some, two of the bacon onion Swiss uh, burger. And Glenn will probably try those as the onion kind of killed it for me. So there's two of those. A grilled ham and Swiss sandwich. So I'd probably try that one. And a roast beef cheddar on a split top bun. So, and here in this bag, there are six breakfast sandwiches from Quick Trip. They are croissants, breakfast sandwich croissants. Uh, some of them are bacon, egg, and cheese, and some of them are ham, egg, and cheese. So, And they are frozen. So yeah, that's pretty good. And this here is from uh, uh, Festival Foods, and these are miniature sugar cookies. So you dip those in uh, coffee, or I think I might dip them in hot chocolate tonight. I was going to make a dessert tonight, but uh, I think we'll just go ahead and have these, and I think I'll make a, a hot chocolate and dip those in there. I think that'll be pretty good. And then we got a six-pack of Glazer Donuts. They call them Glazer. This is from Quick Trip. Um... Might have to just throw these in the microwave a bit. They are a cell date by 1021, which is about four days ago. So they're a little bit on the stale side. And uh, But I think maybe if you just throw them in the microwave. My dad, I tell you, my dad was the master of no waste. If If he had these donuts and they were a week old, two weeks old, he would just warm them up and eat them. My dad believed in no waste at all. He was the master of no waste. And if he ever saw us throwing something away that could have been eaten, oh, he would let us have it. As a matter of fact, like if we 
wanted a bowl of cereal. I mean, we practically begged for a bowl of cereal and we couldn't finish it. He would make us sit at the table until we finished it because we wanted it. <laughs> That's just the way my dad was. Uh, he just believed in no waste. So, so yeah, I wish I could be as good as he was. Um, I try to have no waste, but I'm nowhere near as good as he was about it. So, so yeah. All right, let me put these away and bring on the next batch. All right, everyone. So here is the dairy products. Look at this. We got three, three dozen of eggs. Man, they were just like giving out the eggs like crazy. And again, these eggs are donated by Quick Trip. Uh, Nature's Touch is the brand Quick Trip uses. And yes, all those eggs were donated. They were giving everybody three dozen eggs. So that is amazing, especially with the cost of eggs. Um, Quick Trip is probably still the cheapest for eggs right now. When they were at normal prices, Quick Trip was 99 cents, so they were the cheapest. But sometimes I was able to get them even cheaper than that at Pick and Save with a digital coupon, but not anymore. Um, so thank you to Quick Trip and everybody who donates to the food pantries. We got two more blocks of this cheddar cheese. So these are going in the freezer as well as the other ones. Uh, we got tons of cheese. Uh, this is a one pound bag of quesadilla cheese. <laughs> That's pretty good. And this is a one pound bag of just shredded cheddar cheese. White cheddar, I guess. So that's good too. That'll be going in the freezer. And look at this. <laughs> I think there's like one, four, six, eight, a dozen of English muffins. Wow. And then two loaves of bread, one white bread. These also donated by Quick Trip. And one uh, loaf of uh, split top cracked wheat bread. It's been a long time since I had wheat bread, but I did uh, eat it at one time. So that is our dairy, and I'll bring on the meats next. Okay, so this is the last part of the food pantry haul. And this is all the meats that we received from there today. Uh, another box of Mrs. Paul's fish fingers. There's 15 in there. These are the best. These are definitely the best, but you can't find them locally. I don't know who's donating them, but I wish I did. And nobody can seem to find out who's donating them, but they are delicious. I'm not much for uh, fish sticks because <laughs> they just taste horrible, but these are really good. I tried them in fish tacos and they were good. So... Glad to see those again. Got a pound of ground beef, and this is 80% lean, so that's good. I think what I'm going to do with that is when Glenn has pizza burgers, I used 80% the 80-20 ground beef, and that this happens to be it, so I'm going to save it for whenever he has pizza burgers. We got a two-pound container of ground chicken. Never used ground chicken before, but I'm sure it's the same as ground beef or whatever, but two pounds. Excellent. And not sure what kind of sausages these are. Um, I don't know if the label's on backwards, but it doesn't look like anything's there. But nonetheless, it actually looks like it might have some uh, spicy stuff in there. Maybe bits of jalapeno. So maybe Glenn will try those. And then look at this. A beef New York strip steak. So I think, uh, Glenn, obviously, Glenn's going to have that because, one, I'm not a big steak person, and uh, that's not a big steak at all. So that'll be enough for Glenn, hopefully. <laughs> but grateful to get it, definitely. So that is our final monthly food pantry haul of the month of October. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for tuning in and taking this time out of your day. I appreciate all of your support. And with that, remember to live life, be good to yourself, be good to others. Until next time.